let's do this. Okay, we're gonna make another pass. Wait for Chubb to catch up. I know Chubb doesn't care, but. Okay, so don't pause, just walk right by. Don't encourage him, just see what he does. Chubb's down here chilling. This is the cat room again. We're gonna send the video to the oh, job. Oh, somebody's considering them. Yes. Huh. She has a he a cat. Uh huh. He what, Max? He wants to help her. He wants to help her. Yeah. Well, if her cat has been with dogs, it has. That makes a big difference. So she's okay because she <laughs> the cat is used to Airedales. Oh, but and they're she want, so big. They are so big, but mm -hmm. she doesn't want. And they're terriers. I know. And that's a different story. It is. Cats can be small birds. <laughs> well, yeah. 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 They really are. They're so active and, and interested. And so, yeah. And the thing is, this adopter's in Michigan. So that's why oh. I'm like, I'll videotape. I'll show you the videotape. Uh -huh. I mean, can he be redirected away from the cats? Yeah. Because her cat is used to playing chase and whatnot with her. Her Airedale died. Oh, and yeah. she said she can block off half the house. She said, I have an intro plan, but I don't want him to try and eat them. Well, yeah. So, how does it look to you? Have you done other dog and cat tests? Yeah, I'd have to spend a little more time to get a real good feel. He seemed pretty interested. He did. Um, just in that brief little encounter. Like, okay. I would think he, he wouldn't. He, he, I could see that he might really want to chase and you know, go get, get more interested. But, you know, I don't know. I don't know either. And that's a long 